Hey, how's it going everyone? Today we're gonna be summoning on the Blazing Bash Kaguya banner and I know I actually wasn't gonna do this and I'm still very hesitant to say the least but instead of making a video talking about whether you should summon for her or not man I just I've been thinking about it a lot and we can look at the teams that people are using during this qualifying like I still haven't even jumped in yet because I've been determining like whether I should or not until I have Kaguya or wait till all the people that have Kaguya are already S10 so just looking at the teams man and look, Kagi is in every single team, along with Toby Rama, of course, and it's still gonna be annoying for me without Toby Rama. But you can just see that because of the body boost, that could also play a big part. Kagi is everywhere, man. So everybody's using her, and you definitely want to try to get her for PvP. I'm not gonna say that you necessarily need her, but you know, PvP's broken nowadays anyway, so it's up to you if you believe you need a unit or not. But I'm definitely gonna tell you that to do well this qualifying league without wanting to break something thing you're probably most likely gonna want to have the Kaguya so that's exactly what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go ahead and try to summon for her and all at the same time I'm only gonna do two steps because then I'll, I'll still have enough time to get pearls back before I want to get to 400 so I can have enough to do one rotation of the New Year's banner so I'm almost to 400 if I do two steps which is 70 and that's the rates up for three times which I recommend if you do want Kaguya but you don't have a lot of pearls at least do the first two steps and test your luck because she is at a 1% on the second step and I've seen people pull her on the first step so hopefully you know man i have some luck here i really hope i do but i'm only gonna go on the first two steps so let's go ahead and get into this so for the first step it's only 30 pearls and she is at a 0.33 percent and one thing i forgot to mention when it comes to this kaguya banner is that she's actually featured in the guaranteed pool and that's something i didn't really notice because the other units aren't that good but kaguya if you have a one in four chance to pull her only six summons in that's not too bad and i'm assuming you could even pull her on the third step as well which i wish i could do but i'm not going to spend that many pearls so i'm just going to go ahead with these first two so the first step let's go ahead and jump into it man i'm really nervous because i really want her just so it's not going to be so much of a pain during the kage league as well but uh, we'll see we'll see uh, let's just jump into it man everybody's been showing me they've been pulling in on the first step second step and i'm just like okay that's good because you know you guys should only go in for like the first two steps at the very least because the thing is like the first two steps are usually the only things you should go in on blazing bash banners all the time that's like the golden rule kind of i mean the third step you could argue because the guaranteed pool but it's up to you one gold oh my god my heart i can't take that whenever all those silvers flash i can't take that man especially because we didn't get sakura chan where was sakura during all this please please be kaguya bro <gasps> the worst unit in the game of course it is <laughs> of course it is oh my goodness if another thing is too if you look at the units that are in this banner they're actually really horrible like look sai is right there underneath kabuto and i think that's the blazing bash kabuto but everybody else is so horrible there's not a single other blazing bash unit that's not on the featured pool on this it, it's horrible so i got literally sai the worst unit in the game as far as a six star is concerned <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and jump into this again, man. Uh, and the thing is, I already had that side too. But okay, so she's at a 1% and we will get the resources too because I don't even know if I have that many. But all right, let's go ahead and jump into this, man. Oh my goodness, one summon down already and it was Sai. Sai of all things. Come on, Kaguya. Uh, Kaguya is a cool character. I mean, when it comes to like a benevolent force like that, we didn't even get Sasuke this time. Oh no, I can't take this, man. But, you know, at least maybe getting Kaguya, that'd be pretty good to get because she's going to be crazy this time around for this qualifying league. She is broken. She really is. So, please, man. Please give me Kaguya. I want her so much. I really want her so much. Three goals. I want her more than the Sage of Six Pass Naruto, man. I really do at this point because, you know, I just don't think I'm ever going to get Naruto. Come on, man. Three golds. Come on. Be a pop. <gasps> let's go i got her yes oh my gosh i'm so happy bro let's go it was so worth it I, you guys don't even know i would have been so disappointed if i didn't pull her especially because today I've, i haven't been feeling that good about stuff so let's go i pulled kaguya i'm so hyped let's go man i recommend you do the first two steps no matter what even if i would have got shafted it there's no point in like not because I'll talk about how I'm going to get my pearls back anyway after this. So it's if you guys are confused why I'm so... Oh my god, that artwork looks beautiful. Look at that. It's like a snowfall. Oh, yes, bro. Let's go. Let's go. All right. If we get another pop, then I don't know what it could be. But 
Jiraiya. Okay, I was gonna say, yeah, you can't, also, you can't get the Anniversary Naruto in this anyway, because like I said, the only other Blazing Bash unit featured in this, I think, is the Kabuto, aside from the other three units that are featured on Step 6, of course. Let's go. All right, Kaguya, Step 2. I am done. I have 318 pearls, and real quick before we take a look at her, I'll go ahead and tell you guys how I'm gonna get these pearls. I'm gonna go ahead and tell you guys how I'm gonna get these pearls back. So, I already did everything for the Super Impact, except for the body element on S rank, so that's another five pearls right there. On top of that, it's safe to say that once this Super Impact goes away in 13 days, which is roughly two weeks, that's when we're gonna get the New Year's banner. So 13 days, if you do your daily missions every day, including today, that's 52 pearls right there for your daily trials. And on top of that, we also have the Qualifying League right now, which I have not gotten to S10 yet. So 52 plus an extra 40 pearls, that's 90 roughly right there, 92 pearls. So that'll get me up to 400 again so i'll have enough for new year's thank god i pulled her oh my goodness i'm so happy about that so let's go ahead and take a look at her so i walked away with four golds i think i'm safe in saying this tintin is what isn't she a fake i haven't seen, yeah she is a fake so we got one fake gold and yeah okay so i mean the thing is this banner isn't that great except for, like the rates are but like the thing is there's so many not featured units in it like i wasn't expecting the other golds to really be anything too hot unless they were dupes of her but okay we got the side don't want him i already had a copy of him jiraiya i didn't really want him either but we got kaguya otsutsuki herself so let me go ahead and uh lock her real quick let's go man i wanted her so badly this kaguya is so broken if you guys don't know she pushes back so far man and that's just insane to me because we haven't had a soundable pushback unit in a while i don't think so i'm not gonna go ahead and feed her any acquisition stones i don't believe i mean you don't really need the acquisition stones i feel like but as you guys saw everybody is using her literally in the top teams so yeah you kind of need to have this kaguya if you want to get through without a problem i'm still gonna struggle because i don't have toby rama and i don't have anniversary naruto but with that attack boost that all the body units are getting if you have this kaguya she's gonna hit like a tank and her speed goes up as well if you have that last ability i'm not gonna have it so she might not be too viable when it comes to that but she's still really good nonetheless so there we go kaguya i'm gonna go ahead and awaken her one more time to her blazing awaken form as well all right so there we go and the resources were all free because i got it on the second step so it was a gg let's go blazing awakened kaguya looking beautiful looking beautiful all right man so yeah she's definitely gonna help out man I, oh i'm so glad i got her i can't believe i pulled her i wish i could have this ability um the immobilization resistance to be honest would be good maybe i'll give her one dupe just so i have immobilization resistance because i do have a lot of acquisition stones but as far as everything else that's not too crazy uh but yeah all right so there we go that's kaguya otsusuki and i have her so there we go that's gonna be it for the summons i was really really hesitant to do this i knew it was gonna be a stupid idea but i don't regret it because i wanted to cop her anyway especially because the last blazing bash unit that i got outside of the anniversary was like blazing bash hinata so it's been quite a while since i've summoned on a blazing bash banner again like i said i did get anniversary sasuke but you know anniversary periods are a little bit different so i went ahead and picked this girl up and i'm really happy that i got her because it's gonna make the qualifying league just even more simpler so yeah but yeah i hope y'all enjoyed this best of luck to anybody and all of you that have pulled her on twitter speaking of people who pulled them on twitter this person they pulled kaguya on the first step which was really crazy so that was one of the per people i was referring to this person got two of them on a point 33 and then i guess they did the rest of the rotation because you can see all the other units they got so that's insane especially because i'm guessing that point 33 was later on not the first step but that's pretty dang crazy if i would have got two of her right there it would have been insane but yeah that's gonna be it thank you all so much for watching i hope you all enjoyed and i'll see you all in the next video.